In this video, I'm starting the decorating in the living room. Hi, it's Sharon from Sherry's Fairies. And this is my decorating in my house. It's not stuff that I've made, but it's stuff that I've arranged. <laughs> Anyhow, I think it's a cute little video. And I'd like to welcome any new subscribers. Welcome, welcome, welcome. And of course, thank you, thank you, thank you so much, my regular subscribers. I really, really do appreciate you guys. Okay, let's get on with the show. Okay, this is some of the decorating I've been doing in my home. My husband hung the TV on the wall, so I have this nice counter to decorate. So I had lots of fun putting all my little decorations up. But first, he put out his Charlie Brown tree that he has had out every Christmas. And I thought, well, that looks cute. We'll just leave it right there. And so I brought out my little goodies. And I knew I wanted to put my bottle brush trees there. So I just placed them up on the speaker. And that worked good. And we've got nice white ones. And we've got these little green ones. And some of the green ones are in little red boxes, which I thought was kind of cute. And I have my wooden ones that I painted white. You saw in my last video. And then I bought these little guys. And this one's a little squirrel with a fuzzy tail. I just thought these guys were so cute, I couldn't resist. And they had them at Michael's, cheap for the price of one. So I bought four. And I got this sweet little teddy bear who has a present. And this little guy, I don't know if he's a squirrel or a chipmunk. Not sure, but he's sure cute. He's got a present and a scarf around his neck. Very sweet. This other one, he has a little vest on that I didn't show you. But I just thought they're so adorable. And the fourth one, I'm going to say it's like a little bunny rabbit. Or a little mouse. Yeah, maybe he's a mouse. And he's got a present and a, he's got on his bow tie. And I think he's just adorable. And I put green stuff all in and around just to make it look kind of festive. I think my little animals are pretty darn sweet. I think this turned out really well. Most of these are picks. I got them at the dollar store. Some of the picks I made myself. And I just had stuff laying around. If you hear that noise in the background, that's just my husband coming back from the store. And we have these candles that Dave got and their remote control. So we'll be able to turn them on at night. So, this is my new shelf that I get to decorate. I think it's just wonderful. And down below here, I have my advent calendar. And I've opened two already because this is December the 2nd when I'm filming this. And they're all really sweet little bags with numbers on them. I just think they're very pretty. 
some of the presents were too big, so she put them in the paper bags, which is pretty cool. So I'm excited to open up my advent calendar from my daughter. And I made her one, and I'll flash a picture of it. I hung it on the wall at her house, and it's in the shape of a Christmas tree. So, here's one more look. There. Well, at this time, I'd like to welcome all my new subscribers. I'm so excited. Hopefully get to my 500. And also, thank you, thank you, thank you, all my regulars who come and watch me every week. I really do appreciate you. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. It's free. And hit the little bell, leave me a comment, and a like if you like it. This is the basket that I have on my table, on my coffee table, and I decided that I'd add a couple little green wreaths in it, and then I'd add some decorations to it. And this is what I came up with. Now, set the little house in here, and put a riser in there to rise that up, and I put a bunch of the older Christmas balls in. I quite like this one. Okay, I'm gonna go get the riser. One more button in. That's good. Guess who got a new Christmas tree? And it's very complicated. Setting up the Christmas tree. So we got a new Christmas tree and it you can have it lit white or you can have it lit with colors. You can have it go white and then colors or you could just have the colors flashing. All kinds of fun things you can do with this Christmas tree. So we had many little things we had to plug in, well David plugged in and got it all organized and we got it finally set up. And of course with the new tree there's always lots of fluffing to do. So that's what I'm doing. Oh, and you that. can just kind of swirled in the tree. Just up and around. And I think it looks quite pretty. So, I'll figure out how to add the other two. See what I can do. One's on. This is the smaller one. And then the larger one. And then the smaller one. And the larger one. And then some more smaller one. And I think this turned out nice. And I've also added birds. We have some red cardinals, some white birds. Some of these birds are just from the dollar store. And there's another red cardinal. It's actually in a... I 
And I have some cute little owls. And I have a little bird in a nest. And I've added some big blue balls that have reindeers on them and snow. Some of these decorations come from my daughter's house. And we share decorations. And this little glass angel. A friend gave to me. Years and years ago. So it's nice to have it back. And a little bird. And I think there was a Christmas tree. But I'm not sure. I'll have to look through more decorations at Jody's. And so what I'm doing right now is I pick these decorations out to put on the tree. And then I have the decorations that I made last year. And that'll go nice on this tree. The white ones and these ones. I bought these pretty little hangers to hang them up with and I think it just adds a little bit to the decoration to have it on a pretty hanger like that so I'm going to put these hangers on all these decorations here and get them on the tree on our Christmas tree. We've got our big Santa tree topper again this year. I love that tree topper. It has lots of sentimental value. Plus it's just really awesome looking. And I'll give you some close-ups. Some of these decorations are probably from Oh, I don't know, the 30s. Anyhow, some of them are very, very old. David's dad lived to be 100. So I'm not sure when they bought them, but I have a feeling they had them for many, many years. And of course, there's my cardinal. And the special angel from my friend. And here's a pretty old one. And it's that hot pink, which I find interesting. Yes. This is just a cheap uh, decoration that I bought years and years ago, but I really liked it. And then we have some of these balls that I bought at the same time. And there's another older one. And I got those at the thrift store this year. I thought they were pretty. And we got more birds. These little birds are just from the Dollar Tree in the Dollar Store. I thought they were cute and they look like they have little sweaters on. Might pick some more of those up. They were pretty cheap. This is one of the ornaments that I made last year for the tree. I did a tree last year and I made all the decorations. One of my favorite things for my Christmas tree is icicles. And these ones are just, they're from Canadian Tire and they're just plastic. But they show all the lights and everything, so I thought they were pretty. And as a filler, I have got these from the thrift store and they're very, very dark burgundy. And I thought they added to the tree. This is another decoration that I made last year. And then it's also burlap. And I painted it white. And I put the pit berries on. And eucalyptus. And some greenery. And instead of using beads or garland of a different kind, I put on this flocked garland. 
I bought that last year. This is one I got from, I'm not sure, one of the, I'm not sure which store, but I know I bought it last year when it was on sale. And this one here I got from the thrift store. It doesn't have lights, the other two do. And there's that pretty, pretty blue ornament with the deer on it and the snow. Many, many pretty ornaments. So, on this garland, it has big pine cones that are got the snow on them. And then here's another little birdie. Quite like the birds on my tree. Here's another old fashioned one. And you can see the hanger on that one really well. I bought these hangers this year for our tree and I really, really like them. I think they just give a little more zhuzh to the tree. I always wanted to say that word, zhuzh. Zhuzhing my Christmas tree. And of course down below we have our little village set up and if you follow my channel you'll see I have a little fairy garden under there I did that for fairy garden Thursday and that was fun and this tree you can have colored lights or you can have white lights and I decided that I liked the white lights on the tree. And as you can see out the window, we got some snow. So that always makes it look pretty outside. I do prefer the snow. So those are the decorations on our Christmas tree this year. And we're really enjoying it. And on my window over here, I put those white house clings on this big window. And it looks good from in here and it looks good from outside. And I got those at Canadian Tire. And I have a few in the kitchen, which you'll see in my house tour, my Christmas house tour. Well, thank you very much for watching and this is what we did in this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!